Good morning. Welcome to Alpha Omega's Column Hinge Temple. We're located halfway between Death Valley and Las Vegas, Joshua Tree and Area 51 in the Mojave Desert of the Southwest United States. And we're just a few minutes from sunrise. Weather's great. There's no clouds on the horizon. Perfect observation. Morning, David. Good morning, Leslie. Good morning, everybody. Buenos dias a todos. Oh, look at that. We are just moments away from sunrise here. In fact, it would have already been sunrise were it not for the mountain over there in the last chance range. We got the shadow of Mount Charleston coming over here. All right. And today, we're almost in alignment with the column, so we're gonna be standing very close to it for ritual when we get started. For those of you who might be here for the first time, you're about to witness a ritual called the opening of the treasury of light. It comes from the lost magic of Jesus. Now, what do I mean by the lost magic of Jesus? Well, there was a very rich magical tradition in early Christianity and this is a stream that was rediscovered in Egypt in 1897. In a manuscript that has become known to scholars as the Bruce Codex. And what's inside there are two things that are absolutely amazing. The first and second book of Yahweh. For these two books contain there it the is. of Jesus talking to his disciples. And the secret magic. Six twenty seven this morning. He is risen. All hail the sun, source of all life on earth. We fell from the stars, and to the stars we shall ascend.
take a nice deep breath and feel into your body. Feel into your joints and your tendons and your intestines. Feel into every part of you. And as you feel into yourself, expand your awareness. And as you expand your awareness beyond your physical body, visualize yourself as the tree of life however it is you imagine that tree to be. And grow your branches up high into alpha sky. Drive your roots down deep into omega earth. I call on you in the east, alpha I call on you in the West, Omega. I call on you in the North, Alpha. I call on you in the south, Omega. Oh, ah, Alpha. Et Omega. The beginning. And the end. And the path of the age between. Sunrise. And sunset. And the path of the sun between. Birth. And death and the path of life between. We now stand here at the place where heaven and earth meet, where the matter of the earth supports the matter of our physical bodies while we watch out, while we reach out to the life force, the God force, in the invisible. Angels of the opening of the 20th treasury of light, attend for I know your names left to us by the Master Jesus. Fitexaiza. Fitexaiza. Aaksaai. Aaksaai. Lizards, Lizards. And there are 12 heads in his treasury. And these are the names that are in the places when they sing praises to my father and he gives light power unto them. Almighty angel in the east, Elazazoi Oia, Elazazoi Oia. Zafosaos, 
Sorry. Oa Zoaes. Oa Zoaes. Oa Zoaes. Sozafi, Sozafi, The Zoias. The Azul 
Azofa'i. Azofa'i. And thus, we completed our journey through the places. Received the power of light from the heads in the places and opened the keys of the 12 gates. At length, we came into the place of the mist, the place of the father of the treasury of light. O oh, father of the treasury of light, Emanation of Iawa. By the power of my Father, by your cipher, and by your name, we invoke you, Zai Zoa. Open the portal and may the divine light descend. It is the intention of this ritual that all those who seek for the waters of life, the abundant life spoken of by the Master Jesus, shall be filled to overflowing in their energetic souls with the God force energy, that they may know what abundant life truly is. And then in that hour when death comes calling to each and every one of us, may we be duly and truly prepared and rise like the phoenix into the kingdom of light, shedding this body like a serpent sheds its skin. And most importantly, let us establish human freedom worldwide. Human freedom worldwide. Protect Homo sapiens from extinction. Protect Homo sapiens from extinction. Protect the purity of our air. Protect the purity of our air. Restore the purity of our water. Restore the purity of our water. Restore the purity of our food. Restore the purity of our food. And protect the sanctity of our genetic code. And protect the sanctity of our genetic code. Finally, all of those who are watching, all of you today, everyone here is in attendance. May your prayers and spells be fueled by this God force energy that we have awakened with this ritual. Now is a good time to express whatever need you may have. Express your prayer. Express your intention. Maybe it's a loved one who has fallen ill. Maybe you've lost your job. Maybe you have a son or a daughter with a drug problem. It could be so many things that are weighing heavy on your heart. God wants to take this burden from you. There are legions of angels here today gathered, called forth by this ancient rite of Jesus. Express your desire. Express your prayer now, and it shall be given to you. Amen. So mote it be. Take a moment now to again feel into your body this ancient magical rite helps you feel more God force on your skin. This is what gives life 
Feel these sensations. Feel deeply into everything your skin is trying to tell you. Because your skin is your connection. It is the connection between heaven and earth. When you stand on the earth, your skin in contact with the God Force energy brings God Force down to earth. You are that divine connection between unseen and seen, between energy and matter, between this dimension and the next. You are a creature of the liminal zone, of boundaries, of borders, and you can make your sovereign self the divine creature you know you are. All you need to do is reach out to the God Force. Feel into your body and those tingles you feel. That, that is the God Force. That's right. Reach out to the God Force. Oh, there's so much life around us in every single second. It's right there with you now, all around you. Leslie and I here are entering deeply into this energetic field. This is the, why we're in the desert, because it's so strong here. What a blessing, what grace it is to live in the power of the God Force, to live in the grace of the God Force, to live in the beauty of the God Force. Thank you all so much for coming out today. We so appreciate your coming out here day after day with us. We're getting a lot of reports from people that are gaining amazing benefits just from coming out to the ritual. We'd like to hear from you too. Be sure and leave us your feedback. We'd love to hear how you're doing and if this ritual has impacted your life in any way. This morning, we have another premiere. Every Saturday morning, we have our Saturday premiere. Today, we have a special guest star, Leo Zagami. Leslie and I will be interviewing him. He's about to talk about and blow the whistle on Vatican Satanism exposed. You're not going to want to miss that. That's going to be in a little more than two hours at 9 a.m. If you'd like to know more about our church, drop by www.alphaomega.church. And if you'd like to know more about magic in general, be sure and drop by the Hermetic Order of the Golden Dawn website at www.golden-dawn.com. And... Until we have the pleasure of each other's company again. May the God Force run strong within you. And, as always, may your magics work better than expected.